Hello, hello, hello everyone. This is Cynthia Toa at Miss Flip It, your Gypsy Medicine Woman here to give you a card reading for the day. Let's see what the beautiful cards have to say today for the collective. Yeah. It's making sure that you're loving all of you, being in peace with yourself, being in, in emotional balance, just enjoying the person that you are, enjoying the soul that you truly, really are. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. What else we got for the collective right here? Right now, today, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> what do the cards have to say? <clears throat> what do the cards have to say? Mm -hmm. It's a beautiful way that you know the divine feminine. She's she's grounded. She's whole. She's complete. Yep. She's worthy, and she's done all of her work to be in that position to be the queen. You know. She's done all the work. Yeah, by how did she do that work is by looking, hanging around and looking at the story differently. Not looking at the story the same old way. Let's just look at the story a little bit differently than, you know, the normal way. Let's let the old way go and let's look at this new way. Looking at the story so you can continue on working. Continue on doing the work as other people are kind of helping you in the background. Whether you can see it or not because your back's turned to them. Yeah, your back's turned to them. And you're doing the work though you you know you, you're looking at the story doing the work keeping a balance keeping a balance within yourself keeping a balance within your journey no matter what's going on so the reading so far all about the divine feminine mm -hmm, what's going on and in the end well, we got the highest priest the highest priest you know wants to you know knows things that we don't know the highest priest can see things you cannot see the highest priest knows that there is um <clears throat> this is a brand new beginning, a brand new start that looks bright, that looks rewarding for your future. That's what the highest priest wants you to know. What else? What else? Yeah, it is about putting an ending. This is putting an ending to something that hasn't worked for you, something that brought dark energy into your, your vibrancy. That's what we're letting go of. Yeah, and you're almost there. It's just, just one thread, just one little thread there to allow that that rebirth to release that lower vibrational story to let that story go mm -hmm. what else we got we got here for the collective <clears throat> yeah we've had we've had some heartache and heartbreak that we've had in the past that we've had to take time to rewrite the story within so we can bring a balance, a balance within our internal self so we're not fighting against each other in, internally to whatever the story was, whatever story that was there that we've rewritten. Now we've rewritten it so we can feel a balance within, bringing, bringing justice to ourselves so you can be operating from this unconditional love. So you're giving yourself so much love. This card has more love in it than any other card in the deck. And you know that there is a, a, an, uh, a, like a soulmate connection going on in the background. Uh, but you're loving the person that you are. You're loving the soul that you are. You're like growing in, you, you know, your, your spirit is growing. Your soul is growing. You're in the middle of rewriting your script over and over. We're rewriting the story, making sure it's operating from a passionate self, operating from a loving self, operating from um, the story that you want to write. That's two aces in a row. That's one, one. That's 11, right? <laughs> oh, we got, look at, this is one, one with 11, with 11. So 11, 11. That's a soulmate connection going on there. The doors are opening. <laughs> yeah. Yeah what's going on well that divine mask and sin i'm getting my i'm getting my thoughts in order i'm getting my thoughts cleared i you know i've gotten i've gone to school i learned what it is i need to know now i'm getting ready to make a forward um a forward conversation because the, he, the divine masculine he knows this story has been written in the book and he wants to make it crystal clear but he wants to come forward as a as in um with maturity mm -hmm. What else we got going here? Put the collective right here today. <laughs> yes, <Yeah, some> motorcycles. <laughs> yeah. yeah, it is about bringing this and <laughs> bringing that. What we have a soulmate connection back there. Yeah, this is about togetherness, party, celebrating, uh, commitment, uh, um, 
marriage you know let, let's have the party let's bring it together let's nourish let's nourish ourselves let's nourish that that soulmate connection let's nourish the um the loving soul that you truly really are let's nourish you baby let's nourish you <laughs> yeah. nourish your soul baby <laughs> live 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 being happy live, live being joyful live being at peace with in harmony that divine masculine yeah he's he's letting go of all those lower vibrational stories down in the past he's letting them go yeah because he's on his way he's on his way you know, i know i've been saying that forever but you know he is he's on his way mm, the passion is oh yeah the desire is yeah 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 baby <laughs> What else, what else is going on here for the collective right now, today? Let's see, let's see what, what the cards have to say now. <laughs> yeah, let's see. Now that Divine Mask, and he's been, you know, he's look, been looking at the world. He's been looking at the story, seeing it, you know, he's trying to figure out, trying to figure out what Divine wants him to do. <laughs> what does Divine want him to do? Divine, I, you, know, you know, this is about an equal give and take. You know, allow the divine masculine, divine feminine. They have as much to equally give and equally receive. It's it's um it's imbalanced with itself. That's kind of what the the divine masculine see. And now, what's in balance is this happy ever after story. You know, bringing the story together because the divine feminine continued on doing her work. She kept mastering up her brew. <laughs> she kept, she kept putting the love potion in her story. <laughs> what story in that happy ever after fairy tale dream of a story? Having everything you ever wanted, allowing the best story. The best story, allowing that best story to come forward, to be present in, into this this moment of time. No matter what anybody else thinks, says, or does in the background, you know, you kept choosing or your higher vibrational story. And that's crystal clear from the Divine Feminine. She's been crystal clear about this story all along. That gives us a Divine Couple here on, in the reading. And the Divine Couple, these two, they are single. These two are single. And they're getting clearer about their journey, their story about coming together. Coming together to live their happy ever after story. Yep. Because they, they're on the same page. They operate the same way. They kind of do the same kind of thing. They're a counterpart couple. They're, they're a power couple. And... Um, what else what else yeah they're, they're, they're lovers <laughs> yeah i can't make it up they're the lovers yeah and the divine feminine she's operating in her power she's conquered those dragons as those dragons kept coming she became friends with each one of them to empower her to give her more passion to give her more desire yeah because <laughs> she continued to lay down any of those old stories that down to rest yeah she did mm -hmm. what, we, what else we got Mm -hmm. We got a divine masculine. He's solid. He's whole. He's complete. He's awesome. He's amazing. He wants to be with his queen. See, this is a power couple. That's two power couples in the reading. I mean, the the power couple is from strength, from from clarity, with with being solid, being grounded, being secure. Yeah, we got a power couple in there. Ooh. <laughs> we'll take them. We'll take them. Take that power couple. Anything else? Yeah, we got <laughs> this is we got a will of fortune. Something's changing. Maybe something's changing with your home or your finances or your love story. <laughs> we got some change going on. This is a divine change. Divine is leading and guiding this change to happen within your guys' story. Anything else? Anything else for the collective here right now today that's watching this channel? For whatever day you come in, it is a timeless reading. Mm -hmm. It's 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 coming in fast. The universe is working for us behind the scenes. It's you know some some things may seem a little bit more intense because it's coming faster. It's like a force. <laughs> it's a force. <laughs> it's a force to have it happen. What's a force for this change? You know the will of fortune change. Something's coming faster than we, what you realize and. I, you know what it's showing here is a <laughs> um let me see yeah give me 
It seems like a beautiful love story to me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's what I see. And until next time, have an awesome, amazing, beautiful day. This is Cynthia Toa, Miss Flippy, your gypsy medicine woman and your inspirational coach. Please remember to come over to my live show every Monday and Thursday nights at 9.30 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. And um, I'm live for three to six hours. Come on over there, get a paid reading or get a free reading, whichever. Or, you know, the, the paid reading gets priority. And um, the free readings, you know, they're just they're just as good, you know. The paid readings helps help support your your, your sponsor, <laughs> but that's okay, you know. Um, I love you guys so very much. Uh, what else? What else? What else, Spirit? You want me to say? I know you want. You're trying. Oh, I have a book out there. Yeah, it wants me to tell you about my book. It's called Flipping Your Emotional Story Around to Better. That's actually the baseline of everything I teach, do, or say. Rather, it's my coaching services. Rather, it's my book. Or rather, it's my card readings. It is about the underlying story about flipping the emotional story that we got going on in the background. Let's flip that story around. To a better story so we can be living in this higher vibrational frequency and until next time have an awesome amazing beautiful day bye bye butterflies catch you